Hey, I'm going to show you something. This is mainly for the general public who comes into truck stops and whatever. I'm going to show you something and I'm going to explain everything. Now, oh, stuck that right up in my face. Let's flip this camera on. Okay, this is a Loves here in Amarillo. If we can get a look over here. A lot of Loves are making these little RV parks for campers and, you know, RVs. Here's the area for that over here at this Loves, okay? So that's where you park if you got an RV or camper or whatever. <clears throat> And even though there's plenty of room over there, this guy has chosen to take the truck parking. And he ain't going nowhere. Actually, it's a female. It's a woman. And it's a real woman. But, uh... I don't know if you have to pay to park over there or whatever, but... And I know some of you may try to defend this person... But they're there. They are there. And if you defend this kind of person, this these guys, I hope you're one of the drivers that comes in here needing a place to park. You're dead tired. And you're under those federal rules and regulations. And every spot in here is taken. And you see that. And you don't get upset. When you're tired... Or you have to park because it's mandated by the government and if you get busted you're gonna so that's my message to the general public that you're out here pulling these campers honestly I think you're looking to be vandalized like you have a place for you and you're not under federal rules and regulations. You can you can go anywhere. You can go to Walmart and they won't hassle you. They'll hassle us. But the thing is, this is bad. We don't like you. And I wouldn't doubt that person's staying there. They got their shit. They got their damn <laughs> these deals, the solar deals. I wouldn't doubt if someone comes in here and sees that and there's nowhere to park and knowing damn good and well this prick ought to be over there and they vandalize. If they leave those solar panels, I wouldn't doubt if they... I mean, you're asking for trouble. That's just a short public service announcement. Get your ass over there. There's the gentleman right there. I just said something to him. <laughs> it's a husband and wife. I'm like, isn't the, isn't the uh, camper parking over there? What? And he got upset. <laughs> I don't give a shit. They, I guess they call you names these days. If, so, if, if you do something fucked up and someone says something to you about it. You know, like... Yeah, he's getting his shit. Get your shit out of here. <laughs> if someone says something to you about it, they call you a Karen. Or if you're a female or a male, they call you, a, I think, a Kevin or whatever. Motherfucker, you're just weak. <laughs> you're just weak. You can't handle somebody telling you something. I mean, shit. I didn't go tell on you, I didn't go, you know, I didn't go call the cops. I came to you directly, like how it's supposed to be. Anyway, they're getting out of here. No big deal. Just hurry the fuck up, asshole. <laughs>